the fictional universe of the Star Trek canon, which evolved out of the 1966–69 TV series Star Trek, is a vast complex of planets, organizations, and peoples that together comprise an example of the science fiction practice of worldbuilding. Topic G. Gagarin IV, location of the Federation's Darwin Genetic Research Station. Possibly named after Yuri Gagarin, the first human in space in 1961. Gaia, Gamma Quadrant Class M planet surrounded with a strange quantum energy barrier. In the 22nd century, the planet was colonized by the crew of the USS Defiant who were sent back into an alternate timeline when the Defiant crashed on the planet and could not send a distress call. Galador 2, a Galador freighter is described as traveling between Farius Prime and Galador 2 in DS9 episode, The Maquis. Galdontair, planet where the alien known as the Albino hid after enacting his revenge against the Klingons Kong, Kor, and Koloth, Galen IV, planet contested between the Federation and the Talarians. It is the birthplace of Jeremiah Rosa, Jano, Gallows II, planet with a ruling family named Tanagra, Galore IV, location of the Daystrom Institute, Galorda Prime, planet where in 2370, a Klingon transport crashed, Galorndon Core, a magnetically unstable planet near the Romulan neutral zone. In 2366 Lieutenant CMDR. La Forge is trapped on the planet with a Romulan survivor of a crashed shuttle named Centurion Bakra. The electromagnetic storms blinded Geordi's visor and paralyzed the Romulan's nervous system, and the two had to work together to survive. The planet was a rendezvous point for the delivery of a stolen deflector array. The Romulan commander Chulik was defeated here. Galvin V, planet indicated by data as having inhabitants who only consider a marriage successful if the couple has a child within the first year. Gamelan V, planet threatened by a space barge that leaked radioactive waste into the atmosphere. Gamma 400 system where Starbase 12 is located. It lies near the Mutara Nebula, Gamma 2, an uninhabited planetoid where an unmanned Federation research station is located. It was visited by the USS Enterprise Gamma VA, a system around a fourth magnitude sun with billions of inhabitants, killed by a giant space amoeba, Gamma Canaris IV. Planet Commander Kieran McDuff, a disguised Saturn, claimed he was from Gamma Canaris N, planet where the developer of warp technology, Zephram Cochran, survived alone for many years. Gamma Hiromi II, planet in the Hiromi cluster where a group of Akamarian gatherers planned an ambush of Federation personnel, Gamma Hydra II, Captain Kirk, under the effects of rapid aging, mistakes Gamma Hydra IV for Gamma Hydra II, Gamma Hydra IV, a planet with a Federation research station where the science team is found suffering from rapid aging, Gamma Tori IV, location of an unmanned Federation monitoring post. In 2364, the Ferengi stole a T9 energy converter from the station, Gamma Trianguli V, a tropical planet whose primitive inhabitants worship an ancient computer called Vol, Gamma Virtus IV, planet whose inhabitants are mute, Ganalda IV, location of a battle during the Second Federation Klingon War where the Klingons were forced to retreat, Garadius IV, destination of the USS Enterprise D on a diplomatic mission but was diverted to help a disabled Romulan science ship experimenting with an interphase generator, Garinor Homeworld, a Delta Quadrant planet, the entire Garinor species was erased by the Krenum with their temporal weapon, Garan II, planet where Lt. R. O. Lauren disobeyed orders resulting in the deaths of eight fellow officers, Gaspar VII, Federation colony, home of Capt. 
Edwell, Galt, a farming colony where Lieutenant Worf was raised under the care of human guardians, Getty Prime, Federation Recreation Planet, said to make Riza look like a tourist trap. The doctor challenged the hologram reg to a game of golf on the back nine at Getty Prime. The name Getty Prime echoes both the fictional Getty Prime home of House Harkonnen in the Dune series and the real Prima Gidi or Algidi Prima star system. Gemma IV, Kazan Slave World, Gemaris V, Homeworld of the Gemarian Species, Gemulon V, Destination of the Federation Colony Ship SS Santa Maria which instead crashed on an uncharted planet in the Aurelius system. CMDR Sisko and Chief O'Brien, finding the lost colony ten years later, discovered that the ship had been deliberately marooned there by Elixis, a woman who believed mankind should do without technology. Genesis Planet, a planet created by Dr. David Marcus's Genesis device that was detonated by the renegade prince Khan Noonien Singh. Genesis aged rapidly and exploded not long after its formation as the result of protomatter used in its creation. Gorista, homeworld of the warp capable Goristan species who attacked the USS Adelphi during a botched first contact mission. Gideon, planet visited by the USS Enterprise whose inhabitants have repeatedly refused to establish diplomatic relations with the UFP. Non-canonical and semi-canonical sources identify it as planet number 7 in the Delta Dorado star system. Gideon supposedly has a naturally near sterile environment whose inhabitants have remarkable self-regenerative abilities and thus are incredibly long-lived, and the planet, when the Enterprise encountered it, was severely overpopulated as a direct result. Golana, Bajoran colony and vacation planet, once inhabited by an advanced now extinct civilization. In 2374, a time portal was discovered in a cave on the planet where Molly O'Brien was accidentally sent 300 years into the past when the planet was uninhabited. Gonal IV, planet known for its moth swarms, Gorlin homeworld, capped. Kirk's equivalent in a parallel universe suppressed an uprising on the Gorlin homeworld in TOS episode. Mirror, mirror. It is unclear whether the Gorlin homeworld also exists in Capt. Kirk's universe. Gorn homeworld, the home world of the reptilian humanoid species the Gorns, a species that has appeared in the Enterprise episode, In a Mirror, Darkly, Part 2, and in the original series episode Arena. The Gorn home world is probably the location of the center of the Gorn hegemony. Sources not officially recognized as canon identify the Gorns's home world as Tau Lasserti X. Gothos, a rogue planet encountered in the middle of empty space. The puckish Trelane, an immature representative of his alien race of sapient discorporates, controlled the planet, moved it about the galaxy, and molded it into a personal playground with the help of sophisticated machinery, which he called mediums of instrumentality. Gramilia, known for Gramillion sand fleas, Gravesworld, planet named for Dr. Ira Graves, a genius physicist who was dying of Varney's disease. He cheated death by uploading his consciousness into the android Lieutenant CMDR. Data. This act disgusted Kareen Bryanon, Graves' young assistant with whom he was in love. Graves eventually left Data's mind, transferring all his knowledge to a computer bank, but his soul seemed to had finally passed on. Grazer, homeworld of the Grazerite species. Topic H. Hatoria, Klingon colony, Hadera, Y-class planet in the Delta Quadrant, chosen as a new home by renegade holograms. The name means, Home of Light, in Bajoran, Hockton 7, Federation colony in the Cardassians DMZ, Hocken, Delta Quadrant planet featured in the Voyager episode, Pathways.
Halana, homeworld of the Halanan species, Haley. Haley is a system in Klingon space known to have a world with a savage and deadly environment. It was once customary for Klingon criminals who are sentenced to death, to be taken to the world, given a weapon, and stranded there to face the dangers so they can die as warriors. Hali, homeworld of the Halians, Halkan homeworld, presumably properly named Halka, a planet surrounded by spatial conditions that can cause ion storms and inhabited by the Halkan people. The USS Enterprise visits the world to persuade the inhabitants to allow the Federation to mine dilithium there. The inhabitants, however, appear to have little interest in a Federation alliance. Hanoli, the Hanoli system was destroyed by an expanding subspace anomaly in the 23rd century. Hanan IV, inhabited Delta Quadrant planet in an early stage of development similar to Earth's Pliocene age. Hanaran II, destination of the Enterprise E for an archaeological mission before it was diverted it to the Baku system. Hansen's planet, planet inhabited by primitive giants similar to those found on Taurus II, Herakis V, planet visited by the Enterprise D, Herod IV, featured in the TNG episode, The Perfect Mate. Haven, a paradise planet featured in the TNG episode, Haven. It is also known as Beta Cassius. The Enterprise D stops for shore leave. The planet is rumored to have mystical healing powers. Hayashi, star system where the Enterprise D is ordered to prepare detailed exospheric charts of the system as the first step toward planet colonization. Hakaris II, planet along the Hakaris corridor whose inhabitants were threatened by a subspace rupture caused by the passing of ships in warp. The Federation passed a non emergency warp 5 speed limit for all ships hell inhospitable delta quadrant world discovered by the USS Voyager in 2372 a reptilian race used the planet as a breeding ground Hemakek IV delta quadrant planet used as a Kazan Maquis rendezvous Heva 7 delta quadrant planet site of a refueling station Hook IV gamma quadrant world in the Lantar Nebula Holberg 917 G a planet visited by the USS Enterprise where the crew meet the immortal being known as Flint Flint had acquired ownership of the planet using the alias Mr. Brack. Non-canonical sources place it in the same star system as Omega IV, described in The Omega Glory. Holna IV, Alpha Quadrant planet captured by the Dominion, Hotter II, featured in the TNG episode, The Offspring. Harada E. Herkos III, a non-aligned world where the negotiator Devanoni Ral spent most of his youth. Topic I. Iadora Colony, Federation colony inhabited during the late 24th century. It is also the location of a starship construction facility, Icarus Primiconia, a fabled planet that lies in the Romulan neutral zone. The planet was the home world of the ancient Iconian species, who constructed stargates that allowed them to travel to other worlds as easily as opening a door. The UFP feared that the Romulan Star Empire might have been reverse engineering Iconian technology for use against the Federation. The Enterprise became infected by an Iconian computer virus after downloading contaminated computer logs from one of its sister ships in the USS Galaxies class, the USS Yamato, which was destroyed after being scanned by an Iconian probe, Icor X, site of Federation Astrophysics Center. One of the places capped. Picard thought of visiting to attend a symposium on rogue star clusters, Idrin, uninhabited Gamma Quadrant system at the end of the Bajoran wormhole, 70,000 light years from Bior. It was explored by the Quadros 1 probe in the 22nd century, Aleri, Delta Quadrant planet and home to the Aleri species. 
It has at least five moons, ILCOM system, a system that was affected by Dr. Paul Mannheim's time experiments, Illidaria, Delta Quadrant Planet and Homeworld of the Illidarians. Located four light years from a Type IV quantum singularity, Illyria, homeworld of the Illyrian species, Inavar Prime, Delta Quadrant Planet where three released Borg, Lancer, Marika, and Pachan, underwent a process to remove their Borg implants. The procedure however left them severely scared. Indri 8, uninhabited planet with a biosphere that was destroyed by the Klingon cruiser IKS Mod Ha, Inferna Prime, planet where in 2372 Quark was sent to testify in a Federation grand jury against the Orion Syndicate. The Syndicate tried to have Quark assassinated before he could testify. Ingram B, a Federation colony, Invernia II, planet where Julian Bashir was raised. It was after witnessing the death of a young girl here that Bashir chose to become a doctor. Iota Geminorum IV, homeworld of the Tribble. Tribbles are cute little furry creatures who breed every 12 hours if fed. Tribbles were considered mortal enemies by the Klingons, who tracked them down throughout the galaxy and obliterated the Tribble homeworld. By the end of the 23rd century, they were eradicated, but Sisko, Dax, Bashir and O'Brien brought some to the 24th century, when they briefly infested DS9, Iratan V. According to his Starfleet file, Zibalian trader Kivas Faho was educated on this planet, Ertak, planet controlled by the Ferengi, Isis III, destination of the Enterprise D after the events of TNG episode. Too short a season. Itamish 3, planet where Jake Sisko's mother, Jennifer, taught him how to water ski, Ivor Prime, colony destroyed by a Borg cube on its way to attack Earth, Iyar, homeworld of the Iyaran people, with whom the Enterprise D has a cultural exchange, Izar, a Federation colony officially catalogued as Epsilon Buddhist 3. The legendary starship captain named Garth was an Izarian. The planet's capital is New Seattle. Topic J. Janus V, a Class D planet featured in the TOS episode "The Devil in the Dark," where a Pergium mining colony resides. The USS Enterprise is called there to investigate the unexplained deaths of miners only to reveal the world is inhabited by the Horda, a silicon-based organism defending its territory. Japori 2, second planet in the Beta Kali star system, Yaros 2, site of a Federation prison, referred to as a stockade by Ensign R.O. who had spent time there after being court-martialed for disobeying orders during a mission on Garan II, Gerido, a moon of Bior, featured in the DS9 episode, Progress. Jorit IV, site of the Federation colony New Providence which was destroyed by the Borg in 2366, Jiraiya, Federation colony handed over to the Kardashians in 2370, Jupiter, or Sol V the largest gas giant in the Sol system. The EMH was developed at Jupiter station which orbits the planet. Topic K. Kabatris Riker mentions that he had gone on a diplomatic mission to Kabatris, where he was required to wear furs. Cabrolai planet in Federation space sought by the Dominion for its native tri-nucleic fungi, which could replenish supplies of Ketracel White, Cabral Eakalon II, homeworld of the Kalon species. 
the planet was orbiting a dying star, home world of Dr. Timison and his people, Caldra IV. The Enterprise D carries a delegation of Yulians to Caldra IV, Kala III, planet in Packled territory, rich in magnesite deposits, Kaminar, homeworld of the Kelpians and Baal, Kanda IV, planet whose emperor of the Seventh Dynasty was named Darmok, Kantar, homeworld of the Kantar species, Kar Telos, system in the Gamma Quad quadrant with thick asteroid belts, Karema, Dominion allied homeworld of the Karema species, located in the Gamma Quadrant. In DS9 episode, Starship Down, Quark learns of the existence of the Karema. In DS9 episode, The Search, Sisko hopes the Karema will lead him to the Founders. Catan, world destroyed in the 14th century when its star went supernova. Under the influence of a Catan probe, in just 25 minutes, capped. Picard lives a lifetime of events on this world, Cateria 7, homeworld of the Veneri species, Caveria, home planet of the Caverian tiger bat, which Jake Sisko was researching, Cavus Alpha IV, planet where the Enterprise D dropped off a colony of nanites that were infecting the computer core. The nanites developed a collective intelligence and consciousness and went to war with the crew after scientist Paul Stubbs killed some of them. Peace was eventually made and Captain Picard declared them a new species and gave them a home on the planet, Kazlati Homeworld. One of the Maquis crewmen, a Bolian, was wearing a medallion he made in a Kazlati design while he visited their homeworld, Kelamane's planet, Delta Quadrant planet notable for its unusual toroidal shape caused by a natural tachyon energy field. In 2376, the USS Voyager was caught in the planet's gravity which disrupted the tachyon field and caused seismic activity on the surface that threatened the lives of native inhabitants. Kalis homeworld, homeworld of the primitive Kalis species located in the Delta Quadrant, Kelton IV, planet that suffered a drought and sought help with the Federation for weather control technology, Kelva, planet in the Andromeda Galaxy, and homeworld of the Kel Kelvinite species who explored the Milky Way galaxy in hopes of colonization, Kelvas V, aka Kelvas Prime, Dominion controlled planet featured in the DS9 episodes, Tacking into the Wind, and The Dogs of War. Kenda II, homeworld of Dr. Dalin Quace, who the Enterprise D picked up from Starbase 133, Kentana, mythological planet sought by the Skria woman Hanik and her people after their homeworld was conquered by the Dominion. In 2370, Hanik came to DS9 believing Bayor was Kentana and sought resettlement there, but the Bajoran provisional government refused to grant them asylum and the Skria resettled on Draylon II, Kesset homeworld. Neelix and Tuvok visited this Delta Quadrant planet, homeworld of both the Kessatians and the Shadow Ibaneths, on a negotiation mission, Kesprit III, planet with two nation states, the Kes and the Prit, whose common border as divided by a force field, as they are highly suspicious of each other. While the Kes have applied for Federation membership, the Prit remain a highly insular and closed society. The mutual race hate between the Kes and the Prit led the crew of the USS Enterprise D to recommend that Kesprit III be denied Federation membership at that time, Kesik IV, Federation colony and birthplace of Balana Torres. She and her mother were the only Klingons on the planet, Quito Enol, homeworld of the Enolians. Note, the planet's name may come from the organic chemistry term Quito Enol Totemerism. Kitimer, Kitimer in Klingon, planet on the Klingon side of their border with the Romulan Star Empire. Location of Camp Kittimer, site of the first Kittimer Accords, a series of treaties resulting from peace talks between the two empires and the United Federation of Planets in 2293. Also the location of the Kittimer Outpost, site of the Kittimer Massacre in c. 
2346, when 4,000 Klingon colonists were killed by Romulans as the result of Jarod's defection to the Romulans. Other Klingons were captured by the Romulans and imprisoned on penal colony Korea IV, Kosla II, home of the Ferengi entrepreneur Plague, who was credited for holosuite technology. Kiberia, Kiberian fire diamonds are mentioned in DS9 episode, Rules of Acquisition. Claystron IV, home of the Claystronian species. It is located in the Alpha Quadrant near Bior. The UFP visited the planet in 2339 to mediate the Claystronian Civil War. Clavda III, planet nearly identical to Dalit v. Clendith, Spock was asked a question about a technological device from Kelndith during his memory test on Vulcan, Koinonian homeworld, once home of two sentient species, the non corporeal and corporeal Koinonians. The corporeal species ended up destroyed themselves and only the non-corporeal entities remain. Colandra, Cardassian's controlled planet featured in the DS9 episode, After Image. Colaris 3, a planet near the Romulan neutral zone that was featured in the movie Star Trek Nemesis. The planet is inhabited by a hostile post-industrial era species. The crew of the Enterprise E find the remains of an android clone of Data named B4. Coltair Ivkora II, planet in Cardassian space, Corallis III, site of an abandoned mining colony. Odo chases the changeling fugitive laws there, Korit, system where families aboard Deep Space Nine were relocated in 2370 when a revolution on Bior seemed likely, Korma, planet with a Cardassian's outpost where in 2372, the Cardassians and Bajorans have a conference to share intelligence about the Klingons. The Klingons later attack the outpost, Koreeding Chorus I. Quark gave Dr. Bashir a bottle of champagne from Cory's I. Costolane, home planet of Campo, whom Lawaxana Troy planned to marry, Kotara Bareth, Kantar Colony, a light year from the Kantar homeworld, Kotati, Delta Quadrant Planet, Kraus IV. Garrick told the Klingon Duras sisters they could obtain fine silk from Kraus IV. Kronos, pronunciation of Konos, home homeworld of the Klingons. See Konos. Kretasa, homeworld of the Kretasan species. Capt. Archer's dog Porthos caught a deadly pathogen here, Kresari homeworld. The Kresari are a race of traders in herbaceous goods who are accused of weapons smuggling. The name of their planet is not mentioned, Krios a.k.a. Creos Prime, a Klingon-controlled homeworld of the Creosian species. Note, it is uncertain if Creos and Creos Prime are the same planet since the planet changes color from blue to green between the two TNG episodes and the Klingons are not mentioned in either TNG's The Perfect Mate or Enterprise's Precious Cargo. K. Teria 7, planet controlled by the K. Terrian species. After visiting the planet, Chakotay accidentally removed a sacred stone from a K. Terrian burial site as a memento and was accused of desecration. K. Terris, homeworld of the K. Terrian species. Atana Joel, a K. Terrian, tried to take over the Enterprise D for her people by introducing a mind controlling game to the crew. Curl Prime, supposed homeworld of the Dominion allied Vorta species in the Gamma Quadrant, but its existence couldn't be verified since Aris, a Vorta operative, and the source of the information, was unreliable. Curl, the homeworld of the Curlin civilization, which died out thousands of years ago. Kayana Prime, Delta Quadrant planet occupied by the Krenum, erased from existence. By a timeline disruption, Kylata II, unexplored planet being surveyed by the USS Defiant in 2371 but, the mission was cut short when the crew detected gravimetric distortions in the trialis system, Kyria, Delta Quadrant planet where the USS Voyager became caught up in a conflict. 
700 years later, a backup copy of Voyager's holographic doctor is reactivated to prove the innocence of the crew, who are still labeled as war criminals. Topic L L-374 system of uninhabited planets featured in the TOS episode, The Doomsday Machine, that is discovered by the USS Constellation to have been destroyed by a planet-eating machine. LSV, planet near the Gamma Quadrant opening of the Bajoran wormhole. Artifacts and ruins were found on LSV that were similar to those seen on the Founders' homeworld, Landry's Ialapa IV, Ferengi-inhabited planet where the flower Zan Periculi grows, Largo Vlorentian system, in the 2009 Star Trek movie, as the Romulans are attacking Vulcan, Capt. Pike orders Spock that if all else fails, he should rendezvous with the rest of the fleet in the Laurentian system. Lazan II, Cardassian's planet with a labor camp where Thomas Riker was imprisoned, Ladonia III, Jadzia Dax owned a plant from Ladonia III, Lidos, homeworld of the Ladosian and Ventu species, Lagara IV, homeworld of the Legaran species, who exist in thick pools of liquid maintained at 150 degrees Celsius, Lemma II, Federation colony, Larishi IV, planet with a ceremonial drink called Tanagra, Levin V, a Federation colony, Legilium, Picard offered to take Ardra to the ruins of Legilium, site of the lost Zotel Emerald, if she won her arbitration, Legobis X, planet where Dr. Bashir went to see a gallery of paintings by Professor Gideon Sayedic, Ligon II, a tropical planet, home of the Ligonians who visited by the USS Enterprise D to secure procurement of a viral antidote need on Styrus IV, Ligo 7. Location of a Federation science station, Lima Sierra 3, capped. Picard mentioned that the Enterprise had visited this planet, which has an odd orbit. Lysipia, homeworld to the Lysipian species. CMDR. Cisco suggests the Lysipians could be involved in weapons smuggling. Lokaek homeworld, Delphic expanse home of the Lokaek species who lost the ability to reproduce and fell on the verge of extinction. They tried to preserve their kind by engineered a genetic retrovirus that changed infected members of other humanoid races into their own, Loracus Prime, planet in the Gagarin radiation belt with pink, purple cloud layers, known to have 5,000 subspecies of termites, Loran III, planet with a fragment of Dr. Galen's genetic code puzzle to find the origin of humanoid species, Laurelian homeworld, planet, whose actual name is not mentioned, whose natives, called Laurelians, breathe methyl oxide, presumably a component of its atmosphere. However, it is known that the Laurelian homeworld is a planet of Gamma Leparis, which is only 29 light years from Earth. Laval, location of a Cardassian's outpost and subspace relay station, Luria, homeworld of the Lurian race. Morn is a Lurian, LYA-3, location of a Federation starbase, Enterprise D's destination at the end of the episode. The Enterprise received a coded message from Federation Command on LYA-3, about suspected Romulan activity in the neutral zone, LYA-IV, planet where the Enterprise D traced the smuggler Kivas Fahos ship in orbit after figuring out data had been kidnapped by him, Lishan, system with a Federation colony located near the Federation Cardassian's border, Lycia, homeworld of the Lycian Alliance who were at a decades-long Long war with the Saturan species. In 2368, the USS Enterprise D crew had their memories erased and sent false orders by a Saturan spy who posed as second in command to attack the Lycian Alliance headquarters. Topic. See also. List of Star Trek planets, ABCFMQRSTZ